Tonight, unrest and damage at the University of Minnesota. This afternoon, pro-Palestinian protesters took over Morrill Hall. That's the building that houses the university's administrative offices. Today's action follows last spring when pro protesters camped out on the mall for days. WCCO's Kirsten Mitchell was there as police cleared the building. Pro-Palestinian protesters took their message from Kaufman straight to Morrill Hall, where they entered the building and took over, raising a Palestinian flag and renaming the building Halimi Hall in honor of a content creator killed in Gaza. I had no idea what was happening until I walked out of my class space. Palestine is our demand! Palestine is our demand! It's been building and this is the explosion. Max, a protester and freshman, says protesters are calling on the university to end institutional neutrality and economically and academically divest from Israel. You are showing a bias if you're refusing to speak a word about what's happening to the Palestinians, but you are still sending money to Israel. You are picking a side, you are showing what side you land on. Protesters got inside the building and then barricaded the doors using things like tables and chairs, even bike locks, to prevent the police from getting in. But they did get in. The university says around 5.40 p.m., U of MPD and Hennepin County Sheriff's deputies entered the building and arrested 11 people. The university writing, once inside the building, protesters began spray painting, including covering lenses of all internal security cameras, breaking interior windows and barricading the building's entrance and exit points. They say staff were working at the time and some couldn't get out for a while. The damage left behind is still being assessed. Hey, Coming to universities about broadening your worldly view, and this is the best way I can see to do that. This is what matters to me, and I'm willing to put it at risk. In Minneapolis, Kirsten Mitchell, WCCO News. Some protesters continued to rally later at the Hennepin County Jail. We'll let you know if any charges are filed. Minnesota Hillel is an organization that supports Jewish students on campus. They told us in part at Minnesota Hillel, our most important priority is keeping Jewish students safe. First foremost and always, Hillel's doors are always open for all Jewish students.